G'day! Um, of course, I had to open what is the third in the weekly series of my uh, behind the scenes video diary with G'day because I'm in Sydney. Yay! Um, this has probably been one of the craziest uh, weeks in terms of uh, being a uh, full-time and freelance travel blogger because I started the week Monday working in the London flat doing uh, usual content and social media updates and here I am, it's now Sunday evening and I'm doing the same thing in Sydney. So you can see just behind me uh, a beautiful Sydney sunset, it's, it's Sunday evening here now um, and I'm working at what is our, uh, an Airbnb apartment that we've rented for the next four weeks. A gorgeous apartment, I'm really relieved to say, um, because you never quite know um, when, you know when you book things over the internet if they are as good as they look in the photos, and thankfully this one is, is far better than we expected. You can just have a little, uh, I can see the room there, we've got a lovely corner sofa, a few bits of artwork, um, huge TV, there, um, yeah, bas per basically perfect size, fantastic kitchen and amenities, and um, really nice, really cosy. In fact, it sort of set the bar really high. Um, this weekend, we looked at eight different apartments in the Surrey Hills area, which is where we want to live in Sydney, and not one of them can anywhere near to being as nice as this place. So, um, yeah, the bar's been set really high. And I, I just hope that over the next uh, three to four weeks, we find somewhere that just as beautiful to live in permanently. So, back to what I've been doing for um, a living this week. Um, I totted up that despite, you know, moving overseas, having half a, a bizarre half a day in Japan, um, flying first class for the first time, which I'll be writing about soon, um, I did still manage to produce eight blog posts. Uh, one was um, I edited a blog post for a client's website, uh, two were guest posts that I edited and published for my travelling website and five I've published on 4430. So on there you'll find uh, details of my sister's big fat Greek wedding in Greece. Um, which I yeah told you guys about and I've now written about the experience so if anyone's thinking of having a destination wedding or a Greek wedding check it out and you can see exactly what you might be in for. Um, I wrote a blog post about the move down under, um, I released, I wrote that, we arrived here Friday morning um, and I wrote that Saturday morning when I woke up quite early with jet lag and um, I've, I've been, although I've been thinking about writing about it, I, I mentioned previously I was waiting until we actually moved here to make the announcement. I just didn't want anything to go to go wrong, but as it as it was, um yeah, coming coming over it's all been been really smooth and re really easy. Um so yeah, I made the announcement about what I'm doing here and why um and how uh, emotionally that it it's t it was tougher than I far expected actually to leave my friends and family. But being here just two days already, I can just tell we're going to have an amazing time. It's a, it is, really is a fantastic city, a beautiful city as well. Um, so yeah, one blog post on the Greek wedding, one on moving down under. Um, I've been doing my judging duties for three mobile. So uh, it was the second week of the contest this week and everybody was asked to send in their landscapes uh, cityscapes and sunsets and I must say that there were some really really good ones I think everybody um, you know the competition hotted right up and yeah you'll find on the blog my favorites from the week and also the winner so you can check that out and see what the winning shot was but also you've got one more week to apply so it's the third week of the contest the prize is a 5k holiday to, um, a, it's a destination of your choice out of 16 that the three mobile feel at home, um, uh, uh, pff, what, what's the word, word for it, the free, feel at home policy, uh, shall we say, applies to. Um, included in that is Australia, um, that's how I'm using my mobile and data from here at the moment but also the States, Sri Lanka, Hong Kong, Italy, yeah, really, really great bunch of destinations, so you and a friend will win a trip there. This week's theme, there is none, it's freestyle, so it's literally your best holiday braggy, and that's whether you're 
on holiday or been on holiday and you've, it's an image you use to make your friends um, feel envious or it could be something that you take back at home that you use to say that you're looking forward to your holiday it's yeah freestyle make your own interpretation but do do enter because it's a great prize and it's it, it's it could be yours um so yeah I look forward to seeing all of the entries for that this week and be announcing uh my favorites and doing my my judging for it on Friday um what else Oh, Tuesday, so the day that I moved out of my flat, that morning I co-hosted a Twitter chat with Air France and a fellow travel blogger, The Travel Hack. Um, that was crazy, uh, hectic, really good fun, uh, really, loads of people joining in, talking about tra their favourite destinations, travel to South America. I had, I think, over 500 direct mentions within an hour from people getting involved in the conversation, so thank you if that was you. And also, um, a, a participant at random is going to be picked by Air France to win uh, two return flights to Europe. So that's going to be announced on the 24th. So if you join the Twitter chat, make sure you check your DMs because I'll be getting in contact with you that way. Um, and yeah, that was just, just great fun um, to be involved in a, in a Twitter event like that, but also to catch up with Monica, who's a good friend of mine, and we went and grabbed a, some lunch. Um, and then I went home and yeah, moved out of my house and got a taxi to the airport and had farewell dinners with my family and started making the journey here. So yeah, busy week work-wise, very busy week personal-wise, fantastic weekend, um, checking out, having brunch in Surrey Hills, cake in Newtown, uh, we've been for a hike in Manly to try and you know, counteract all those calories um, this afternoon. And yeah, just getting back into the swing of work and, and what I've got to, to, to get writing about next week. You can expect content on all of those things I've just mentioned in Sydney, um, as well as writing up the first class travel experience and the day we spent in Japan, which sometimes feels like I dreamt it, but I have a passport stamp. It did happen. Um, so yeah, lots of, lots of content coming your way and uh, lots, of, lots of update on Sydney living. Hopefully we'll have a house not before long and um, I'll let you have a little peek inside that. Um, so yeah, that's my week. Hope you've had a great week. Um, hope you enjoy the rest of your weekend, what's left of it. And um, I'll shortly be off to bed. So thanks a lot. Speak to you soon. Bye.